What's up guys, welcome to Apex. Thanks for tuning in. Samsung has rolled out a brand new update for Samsung calendar application, which a lot of us use on a regular basis. This is a fantastic calendar application, which is available by default on Samsung Galaxy phones. There is no need for any third party applications when it comes to a calendar application. Now for this, we have received a brand new update. There are a few new changes or new improvements, which we are going to discuss in this video. Uh, as you can see, the version number is 12.4.06.15. And the size is about 45.34 MB. Now this update has been received on the Galaxy S22 Ultra and not on the Galaxy S23 Ultra. I still have the previous version running on the S23 Ultra which is placed on the left hand side here and on the right I have got the S22 Ultra on which I have already updated the calendar application. Now in the change log there are about four points mentioned and I was able to figure out a couple of them. The first one says improved stickers then we have option to hide search history add repetition option automatically on quick add menu, improve reminder category colors. Now, when it comes to improved stickers, I'm not able to see any changes when compared to the previous version. Maybe I'm not searching at the right place if you guys are able to figure it out. If you see any changes in the stickers option after you have received this particular update, do drop a comment. The second one is option to hide search history. Now on calendar app, on the top right, we have got this search option. Let's go ahead and tap on it on both these phones. Now you can see on the older version, we just have this mic icon and there is no three dots menu or kebab menu here on the top right. Whereas on the new version, we have got this three dot button here. I'll just tap on this. We get an option search settings. I'll open this. Now you can see we have a toggle or a switch here to show recent searches. If you don't want the recent searches to be shown when you tap on that search button, you can disable this toggle. Now you can see when I tap on search, it is not showing me the recent searches. A minor change, just in case if you don't want the search results to be shown up there, you can disable that toggle. The next feature I want to talk about is improved reminder category colors. Now we all know that the reminder app has been integrated into Samsung calendar application and we can create reminders within the calendar app itself. As you can see, when you tap on this hamburger menu, we have got this option here reminder. I can tap on this to open reminder app and we can set a reminder here which will show up on the calendar. Now here on both the versions I have already created a reminder on 17th of April. You don't see any differences here but when we expand the calendar you see the way it is depicted here the reminder is depicted here is much better. In the previous version there's this tiny bar here and then it shows the description of that reminder and now we have got this kind of representation which looks similar to event representation as you can see here. That's another minor change we have got. The last change which I'm not able to figure out is add repetition option automatically on quick add menu. This is another change which I'm not able to figure out. If you guys are able to figure this out do let me know in the comment section below. These are some changes we have received on Samsung calendar application with this all new update. Let me know what you think and also let me know which calendar app do you use do you use the same samsung calendar application which is available on your galaxy phone or have you downloaded a third party application or google calendar do drop a comment and let me know that's about it if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet go ahead hit the subscribe button and give this video a like if you find this useful thanks for watching my name is salian signing off cheers bye bye